So you found Thebes. How? The ancestors revealed it to us not long after we made landfall. Almost a year ago. Through a scrap of ancient data discovered by Alva and verified by myself. It contained details about the construction of a great underground palace. Where, exactly? Close. Beneath the Great Pyramid in the ruins beyond. Figures. Ted loves his pyramids. Have you been inside? Uh, no. What exactly are you looking for inside Thebes? I thought Alva brought back the data you needed. We risked much to cross the ocean. Therefore, we must unearth every possible link to the legacy while we are here. Especially one as important as Thebes. We will not sail back until I have plundered its secrets. I guess we're doing this. I'm glad you're okay. Oh, you got rid of that machine. But what are you doing here? There's something inside Thebes that I need. I went to Landfall. I met your CEO. We came to an agreement, kind of. And you're going to help us get in? I guess so. The whole thing was a little tense. There's something off about that guy. And I don't understand what he wants from Thebes. I thought we found the data that your people needed back on the mainland. That data will take us years to sift through. The CEO wants faster results. Aloy, you have to be careful. He's... There they are. The legacy tells us that Elizabeth Sobek helped the ancestors cast aside all obstacles. And so it has been today. 
You have been true to your word. I'm pleased. Thebes awaits us below, shall we? Behold, the door to Thebes. A door like no other. Well, you're right about that. It's designed to open for only one man. Ted Pharaoh. But the legacy tells us that he worked closely with Sobek. He trusted her. Surely she could open the door, and so surely can you. Not gonna happen. At least not from this side. You said she was a living ancestor with Sobek's eternal essence. Uh, if I may... Pharaoh, great as he was, did not build his palace alone. We know this from scraps of data we found. The ones that pointed to this location. And we found evidence of passages below. Maybe they were built to aid construction. Or for servants. We can't reach them. The way is flooded and they're too far underwater, but... I... Yeah. I can reach them. There might be another way in down there. You see? With Sobek, there is always a way. Then do what you must to get us inside. This water is It's like a hot spring. It's huge. Exercise room? Here I am again. Hiding in the gym. Writing to stay sane in this crazy place. I can't believe Gregory's dead. Our so-called spiritual leader was fine yesterday. And then suddenly passed away in his sleep. And no one will talk to me about it. They treat me like a child, whispering behind my back, as if I can't cope with death, even after the end of the world. So Ted had other people in here with him, including a teenage girl. A living area. It's pretty big, too. There's nothing normal about a scientist, his daughter, a guru, and, well, let's face it, a harem living through the end times in a trillionaire's underground survival bunker. But now that Kagori's gone, I'm worried things will get even weirder. He helped keep Ted stable for a couple of years, sort of. Without him, who knows? And we don't even understand what happened to him. The girl's right. Nothing normal about Ted. I know everyone's reeling after Grigori's uh, untimely demise. He was a deeply spiritual man who wasn't afraid to rip back the curtain and gaze where few men dare. I've asked Dr. Sumtau to, you know, check on what happened to him. I'm sure he had some kind of condition or something. The main point is that while we certainly miss him, 
We will go on. Everything's gonna be okay. Let's hope this is the way to the main door, so I can let the Quinn in. Look at this place. It's pretty fancy for a survival bunker. There, the door. Let's hope I can open it from the inside. Most of Ted's women repulse me, okay? They're like contestants on a housewife sim preening for the hubby's attention. But Brianna, the hollow singer, she's different. She's always been nice to me. And I love her voice, which has been conspicuously silent since Grigori died. She doesn't speculate or gossip like the others. She knows something. I can tell. And I'm gonna find out what it is. Ah, good. An emergency exit function. Emergency exit. The door is open. Destiny is upon us. I knew you could do it. What's going on? The CO is preparing to enter Thebes. Oh, why are you dressed like Ted Pharaoh? I am Pharaoh, renewed. My essence is the same as his. Across the years, across the generations, his soul is my soul. His will is my will. We are sundered in only one way. I need his final testament, his deepest secrets. And now that the door is open, those secrets are within my grasp. When I have them, I will be complete as he was. I will have everything I need to save our homeland, and, as Pharaoh did, the world. Okay. I think there's some confusion here about who Pharaoh really was. No one knows better than I who he was, who he is. Me. The Renewer, greatest of the ancestors, the man who saved the world, and you. You understand, Sobek. You are her, Pharaoh's harbinger, his assistant. Come, we will descend into Thebes together, as it should be. Bring her the raiment. Raiment? As he is Pharaoh, you are Sobek. For an occasion, this momentous, shouldn't you wear proper business attire? Whoa. No, 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 no. No, I am not wearing that. No way. You will wear the proper attire to mark this moment. Or what? It is said Sobek valued life above all else. Is this true? Fine. I'll wear your raiment. Look at this place. The grandeur. Pharaoh's domain. Simply breathtaking. Excellent. Somewhere in here, Pharaoh left his secrets. Let's go find them. Your magnificence. Perhaps we should leave guards behind to cover our exit? Indeed. Let it be done.
Pharaoh's visage, a monument to greatness. Truly, my CEO. It's a monument to something, I'll give you that. I think this way might lead down. Excellent. Remember every detail of his, Bohai, for posterity. It will be his own chapter in your legacy. Brianna told me that Grigori hacked into restricted files and found out something awful. That Ted murdered important people who worked on Zero Dawn. Find anything interesting? Wonder if I am... Um, I can't I make sense of it yet. There will be no further discussion of your feet, Bohai. So hey, this is weird. Yeah, I tried to warn you. Yeah, sort of. I'll explain everything if we survive long enough. Those certainly look threatening. Huh. Statues. The guardians of Pharaoh's domain. Those aren't statues. Look out! Get the CO out of here! This is just us, then. Thanks. Where's Overseer Bohai? He has decided to return to the surface. A wise choice. We can't afford to lose any more diviners than necessary. So, no more delays. We must proceed. <laughs> Brianna didn't wake up this morning. She's gone. Just like Grigori. And looking up at the giant, Hideous statue of Ted in the Great Hall. Yes, that looks like the way. His eyes. And I know now that he's watching me. He's watching us all. Did you discover some data? A fragment. A, a testament to Ted's power. Ah. When I built this place, when its special systems were designed, I knew what I wanted. Protection, of course. An unlimited power source, that was a given. But also... Control. What did you find? Trust me. I don't wanna know. I guess I don't. throne attached to some kind of apparatus I wonder what it does an impressive setup what is it for I'm sorry CEO I don't know my focus can't read the data here what about the living ancestor is the data lost to her
made a minor adjustment to the gene therapy regimen and added a new cocktail to treat the symptoms caused by the mutations. Hopefully, there will be some stabilization after the next treatment. God knows what Ted will do to us if there isn't. The early results were so promising. No signs of aging, no cellular degeneration, but now... Oh, if only I had access to my old lab in Bangkok, or my old colleagues, or my old liquor cabinet. Stop it. Got to stay positive. For Kenya. You saw something. I could tell. Did the data explain what Pharaoh used this device for? I think he was undergoing treatments to live longer. A lot longer. Really? Could he still be alive? Don't be foolish. If he were alive, he would have kept his essence. It would not have been passed down to me. Remember, he was the renewer. Of course he would have stopped at nothing to grasp the secrets of life and death. But not for himself. Everything he did was for a new beginning. For us, for the Quen. And for his true heir, me. You know, I'm starting to think you're right. You do have a lot in common with Ted Farrow. I knew you would see, in time. Let us continue. His secrets await. Hmm. Is that a small office? For a minor functionary, perhaps? You did this for him? You put, like, off switches in everyone's heads? Kenya, you? you mustn't judge me. I had no choice. If I said no, what would he do to us? What would he do to you? You're my little girl. I was trying to keep you alive. For what, Dad? Seriously, why? So we can be trapped in this underground nightmare? You know what we have to do. Please. Did you find a recording, Aloy? Yeah. I'll share it with you later. Look at all this equipment. We are getting closer to the heart of this place. I can an automated geothermal energy plant right under the city of San Francisco. Break the door down. I'm going to look for another way in. Good idea. It's worked before. Very well. Get to it. What? Let me find a closer spot. Hurry! Break it open! Ah, is that a vent of some sort? Not a bad idea. Did you make it to the other side? Our console. Maybe I can access Ted's foot. There. I'll make a clearance. Got it. Somtown's dead, along with his kid. Found him on the floor of his office this morning, holding hands. Must have poisoned themselves. I never would have put them to sleep. She was just a girl, for Christ's sake. I offered them life, and this is how they repaid me, by leaving me all alone. But I guess I've been alone since this whole thing began. Alone in bearing the burden for the past, for the future.
future. Same old Ted. No matter who dies, he's the one feeling sorry for himself. Less his future. Less his children. Someday they'll come, and I'll be here to greet them. Sometimes that my aging has stopped altogether. If anything, my cells are replenishing faster than normal. I just need some time for the mutations to calm down. Time. I'm an energy. Sometimes that the reactor can give me what I need to grow strong again. To get my shit back together. So I can greet the kids. They're gonna need me. My advice. My guidance. And then I won't be alone anymore. Pharaoh's secrets. Are they here? the ones you're looking for. Then they must be in there. Trust me. You don't want to go in there. Are you mad? I haven't come all this way to stop now. Legacy is mine. Burn it to ash. Wait, no. Pharaoh has it rigged to melt down if... Kill them too. No witnesses.
found something that will help. Not just your homeland, but everywhere. But where's the CO? Oh, he's... gone. I guess you could say he gave his life to help us attain the secrets of Thebes. I see. You must think I'm eminently stupid. What? No. No. The CEO was an entitled egotist who twisted our beliefs into a sickening, self-serving fantasy. And you expect me to believe he sacrificed himself for scraps of data? It's time for the truth, and it better be convincing. Otherwise, I'll simply order these soldiers to open fire. Hold on. You're right. To be honest, the CO screwed everything up. He brought thieves down around our ears and died like a gutless coward. But we really did find something down there that will help your homeland. If I can take it and use it. Now, if I have to, I will fight my way out of here, but it doesn't have to be that way. You can just let me go. And then take credit when things start to improve. Success certainly does sound better than failure. It seems then that our destinies are intertwined. Landfall is open to you. If it will help your cause, you may come and go as you please. But. Alva must join you and report back on your efforts. Fair enough. Thebes is of no further value to us. Obviously, we're going back to the flotilla. Alva, I expect your reports to be thorough. Oh, I thought he was going to have us killed. Oh, and instead, I get to join you. Glad to have you. But you're going to need a little help to reach our base. Varl? I made a new friend. I need you to meet her at the Quen Ferry and escort her back. On it. Can't wait to meet her. Trust me, you'll love it there. Varl will give you a better focus and all the data you could ever want. Head to the ferry. I'll join you back east as soon as I can. 
A diviner must follow the truth, wherever it leads. I'll see you there.